everyone. In true random, there should be an equal likelihood of everything. But in the case of the Ender Chest Kit on Hypixel, is that true? Does the Hypixel network favor some items over others? Let's find out. The Ender Chest Kit. I ranked it as one of the top three best Skywars kit in that video up there. Watch it. The kit gives you three golden apples. Amazing in combat, but its defining feature, an extra chest. This extra chest is supposedly filled with random loot, but how random really is it? It is very probable that most of you haven't considered this question, much less pondered or tested it. But I did, and now, after spending numerous hours conducting a hundred Skywars games, ruining my stats, taking a hundred screenshots, and making a giant spreadsheet, I have finally deciphered the Ender Chest kit. Some questions you probably never asked, like, what is more likely, wood or stone, speed or regen, a regular diamond sword or a sharp sword, what should I bet on getting, and what is the least and most likely items you can get from the Ender Chest kit? All of those questions will be answered in today's video. If you guys are interested and want to support the hours of work I put into this, then consider pressing subscribe. But that said, let's get right into today's video. Before I do give you guys the data, I want to say a huge, I want to give a huge shout out to my friend Andy the Shiny Ash Greninja and Jeray. You probably guys, you guys probably know Jeray. He's been in a lot of my videos, and I want to give a huge shout out to him and Andy. Andy's channel will be in the top right. Watch his videos. They helped me because I didn't want to go into solo and ruin my solo win ratio. I went into duos, but because I didn't want to ruin my duo partner's fun. I ended up playing with a friend. We both ruined our duo stats, but I played about 93 games with Andy and about 7 games with Jeray. And I really appreciate all the time they spent doing this with me because it did take longer than I expected, about an hour and a half. Anyway, let's get into how I did it and what the final results really were. Be sure to subscribe to Andy in the top right. Alright then, the final thing. A quick disclaimer, I did not do different bow types, it just would have taken so much longer. So you're going to have a chance of getting a bow. And really quickly, the way I did this, if you're curious, I joined a duo insane game with the ender chest kit. I took a screenshot of the contents of the chest and then immediately jumped off the map. I did not spend time playing that or else it would have taken a while to finish 100 games of Sky Wars. And yeah, that's set. Let's get right into it. And be sure to hit that thumbs up button. Woo! So, if you don't count the power 3 and power 1 bow as two separate items, there are 28 different items you can get from the Ender Chest Kit. These items are Diamond Helmet, Diamond Chestplate, Diamond Leggings, Diamond Boots, Diamond Sword, Enchanted Diamond Sword, Diamond Pickaxe, Diamond Axe, Iron Helmet, Iron Chestplate, Iron Leggings, Iron Boots, Stone Sharp Sword, a bow, a rod, stake, an enchantment table, enchanted bottles, lava, water, regen pots, speed pots, fire resistant pots, snowballs, eggs, stone, and wood. We're going to be comparing the probability of each one in sets, and I'm going to be doing the diamond set, the iron and stone set, the accessory set, and the competitor set, like water and love are competitors. And before I do get right into it, can you guys guess which ones have the lowest probability and which ones have the highest probability? And leave your thoughts down below in the comments section. If you get one right of the top three, top three lowest, or top three highest, I'll give you a cookie. Psych, but you get credit points if you're cool. So yeah, let's really start this. Excuse the wind, the diamond duels. Let's start off. You have an 18% chance of getting a helmet, a 6% chance of getting a chest plate, an 8% chance of getting leggings, a 10% chance of getting boots, a 23% chance of getting a diamond axe, a 29% chance of getting a diamond sword, a 38% chance of getting an enchanted diamond sword, and a whopping 43% chance to get a diamond pickaxe. That is insane. If you guys did notice, the chest plate actually has the lowest at 6%. It is the lowest item out of every single item. If you guessed it, kudos to you. But you have a very, very low chance of getting a chest plate. Out of the 100 games I played, I only got a diamond chest plate 6 times. The leggings don't fall far behind with an 8% chance. These are the only two items that are under a 10% chance. Consider yourself quite lucky if you get them. 
the iron tools. You have an 18% chance again of getting a helmet, a 20% chance of getting a chest plate, 19% chance of getting leggings, and a 13% chance of getting boots, as well as a 31% chance of getting a stone sharp sword. I think they really balanced out the iron armor. 18, 20, 19 are very close. 13 is not a very far stretch as well. And now onto the accessories. So you have a pre of a one in five chance of getting iron armor. That's of one piece of iron armor. That's pretty good. The accessories. You have an 18% chance of an enchantment table, a 26% chance of bow and arrows, pretty high. A 31% chance of stake, and a whopping one in three chance of both a rod and enchanted bottles. Not together, but you have a 33 point you have a 33% chance of getting enchanted bottles and a 33% chance of getting a fishing rod. That is one in three. That is super high. And now finally, the competitors. Place your bets in the comments for these sets before I say them. Say are going to win. Our matches are Lava versus Water, Regen versus Speed versus Fire Resistance, Snowballs versus Eggs, and Stone versus Wood. That one is only off by a percent, so yeah, let's do it. So, here we go. Our competitors. Water beats Lava with a 29% chance to a 17% chance. That is a very high chance of Water. Speed Pots come out on top and Fire Resistance come out on the bottom. You have a 15% chance of Fire Resistance, a 28% chance of Regen, and a 34% chance of Speed. Eggs range slightly higher than snowballs, but by 4%, 28%, and 24%, respectively. And this one is insanely close. Stone gives you a 49% chance, and wood is a 48% chance. Now, these numbers are close to 1 and 2, but think about this. If you add them, you get to a 97% chance. That means there are only 3 games where I didn't get blocks. You are almost... You are, well, you are 97% guaranteed to get blocks out of your ender chest. If you don't, that is the lowest chance ever. And by the same logic, you're also guaranteed a piece of diamond armor, but I wouldn't, uh, a diamond tool, but I wouldn't bet my life on it. Anyway, guys, that pretty much concludes this video. If you have enjoyed and you want to support once again the numerous hours, then subscribe and subscribe to my friend Andy as well. That said, once again, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Hope you learned something. And I'll see y'all next time. Peace. This video is going to take ages to end.